Hey guys, welcome to a new episode of Just Rolled In. This customer had their Ford Focus ST towed in as they said it lost all gears while driving on the highway. The technician said the manufacturer denied the warranty claim for the transmission as the car has a tune and water slash methanol injection kit installed. This Audi A5 was brought in as the customer ran over a street sign, which ended up piercing the charcoal canister. The customer did not get anything repaired. And this customer had brought in their 2012 Mustang GT500 as they said it stalls on the highway. When it arrived, the technician found it to have no fuel, but also never had the oil changed since brand new and it now has over 12,000 miles on the car. This car was brought in for an alignment after the customer said he installed new lower control arms. The customer had mounted the control arms to the bottom of the subframe instead of the slots in the subframe meant for the control arms. When this vehicle was brought in for a subframe recall, the technician found that somebody had welded this control arm. The customer did not want to pay for a new control arm, so the dealership paid for a new one and installed it during the recall. The manufacturer declined replacing this customer's engine under warranty, as they never changed the engine oil since new. So the customer came to the dealership with a padlock on a belt and did this to his car. When this customer brought in their vehicle to get new tires installed, the mechanic noticed for some reason that the customer had a padlock and chain wrapped around the brake pedal and this very loose steering wheel. This roach-infested vehicle got towed in as it would not start, and to this day, the car still does not start. Customer states engine would not start after replacing fuel filters, so he tried starter fluid and heard a loud bang. The customer used way too much starter fluid, which resulted in the upper intake manifold blowing up. This mechanic had a pretty good laugh when he noticed this car had fake drilled brake rotors. And this customer brought in their Jeep for an oil change, and as they have a rattle and clunk in the rear over bumps. Customer states engine shut off while driving on the highway. The technician isn't quite sure what this piece of metal is from, but it went through the oil pan, which caused all of the oil to leak out and the engine to seize, as the customer kept driving until the engine shut off. Customer states they have a vibration while driving on the highway. The customer had just installed these wheel spacers on all four corners. And this customer brought on their Land Rover as they said it lacks power. The technician found that somebody had put this clamp on a fuel line, so he removed it and it fixed the customer's concern. You can submit clips that you personally took on our website at justrolledinyt.com. Thanks for watching and please consider leaving a like or subscribing if you haven't already.